So, to continue my unlikely metaphor, if in 10 or 20 years from now, Britain is entirely beholden to the Chinese finance and industrial capital increasing stranglehold on the economies, and China tells us that Peter Hitchens must be sent to them because he has trespassed against them, this week made it much more likely that British courts and British ministers will cry uncle and send even their own compatriots, and in this case of Julian Assange, an Australian citizen who never committed any offence in Britain, who never committed any offence in the United States. He was never in the United States. The person who committed the offence in connection with which he is charged has already been punished, Chelsea Manning, and sent to prison. They had the right to prosecute her. Whether they were right to do so is an entirely different matter, but they did, and they convicted, and they imprisoned her. Julian Assange was the recipient of truthful information revealing war crimes committed by the United States and Great Britain. Moreover, Julian Assange published all of that material simultaneously in some of the great media houses of the world. So how come The Guardian isn't facing extradition? How come German papers, Italian papers, Spanish papers, American papers are not facing prosecution for the publication of truthful material which was in the public interest to publish and the publish was massively of interest to the public.